I tried to put the apartment in the best condition that it could be, so that way when I come back, um, knowingly I will be wrecked by Tallahassee and my time in Atlanta, work ethic-wise and focus-wise. So I figured I might as well spend the time now and invest it in a little bit of like culture shock when I get back to get back in a working mindset. Unfortunately, none of the dealerships have the hub or the bearing assembly. So, I'm back to where I started. I shall see you when you have replaced your engine. Goodbye. Don't die. No promises. I don't know. Forest roads are really fun. And. <laughs> see you, man. I'll be back to terrorize the beast once again. Actually, no, I can't because my super is quiet. <laughs> I forgot about that. Well, I'll be back anyway. Driving long distances and like roughing it and sleeping in cars on road trips and stuff. I don't know why I'm so drawn to it, but like when I was 17, I went with my birthday around the country on a 10,000 mile road trip in three weeks. We did 10,000 miles in three weeks and a rental Ford Fiesta SE with two six foot three dudes. And at one point for about probably 5,000 of those miles, no, like 3,000 of those miles, we had another six foot two guy in the back seat with all our camera gear and two bikes in the back. It was, the car was so heavy that going up hills, it would be floored at red line and like just couldn't shift to the next gear because it would just go back and forth. It would shift up and then the car would slow down because it couldn't go up a hill faster than like 60 miles an hour. <clears throat> and um, like when I moved into Montclair, I, I drove like 15,000 miles in the month of August, I think. It's crazy. I just like road tripping. I've kind of missed it, but yeah, I'm doing it now, so. A 944 and an R32. Okay. <laughs> oh boy, that's not so good. Oh my God, that's quite the line of traffic. That's gonna get a lot worse before it gets better. I'm here! As encouragement to get the car fixed starting Monday, I'll fast until I finish the car. So that way, like, double motivation. And also there's like a, a benchmark to, because it's not just time. And then drug back to Tallahassee on like Wednesday or Thursday. Check the car, make sure I don't need lateral links or anything like that. And that'll be done. I'll be done then. Getting somewhere. I broke so many of my pillars and I I recorded way too much, but I'm gonna thin it down best I can. Bailey, what you doing? <laughs> He's excited. You gotta talk now. Remember, he that coffee thing, the things in his ears. I still hold to the fact that he's just ignoring people. <laughs> <laughs> Bailey, come here, boy. <laughs> Maybe I'll concede. Okay. <laughs> Bailey, come here. Looking good for 14. Oh, you're almost 15. Yeah. Good lord. He's old as the hills, as I say. He's old as me minus five years. Five I'm home. Oh, Screw New York, this is amazing. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> so wait, this is this is brisket? I don't. I'm not. Oh, and those are ribs. I'm not a connoisseur of the meats, surprisingly mm -hmm. enough. I just this know. This is all chopped pork. Oh, very nice. <laughs> That's this is pretty proportionally correct to the carbs I'm supposed to be consuming. That's right. <laughs> this is like that amount per <laughs> everything else. Oh. Oh. <laughs> It's gonna be so it's, it's, it's a good day. It's a it's fine, fine day. Look at this. Uh, look at just isn't it amazing? So I made this plate as a joke. I kind of like purposefully like. I don't know if you noticed, but when I got the ribs, I was like, how do I separate this? I just took one off the end, and then took, but the joke's on me because I finished it all. It's all gone. It's good. It's, it went away. I had like two leaves of collard greens though, so balanced, balanced diet. I got seconds. I also finished the seconds. I'm a shameful human being. Happy Mother's Day, everyone. Where she be? Oh, I haven't seen this car in five months. Almost six. Oh, I miss it. <laughs> I miss it so much. Uh, God. It's nice to see it again. But here's, this is why all this nonsense is happening. If you notice, Get quite a bit of camber there on in the in the wrong direction. I mean, that's what it's supposed to be like, like perfectly flush with the fenders, and that's what it's like. I don't know the last time it started was because it's moved obviously since I was here last. But that. <laughs> I've reunited <laughs> with my Subaru. This is where I'm gonna be working on the car. Hopefully that lift, or this lift, one of these will be the one I use. Oh. Is the battery dead? Maybe this thing died again? Oh, I wonder if the alarm's gonna go off. Let's find out. Oh no, I guess the battery's dead. It's odd. Maybe it has been a really long time. Oh yeah, that battery is like dead dead. Oh, I don't even remember where the key goes, Jesus. Maybe it's disconnected. this so much. I'm gonna give it one try to see what happens. It has gas in it. <laughs> That's so easy. Ah! It started! Yes! The lights are on. Oh my god. Return to form.
been almost six months to the day since I've sat in this seat in my original childhood dream car and driven a manual. <laughs> it's also really weird because uh, this car is a throttle by wire and that car is uh, like throttle by cable. It's really different. You can definitely feel the flat spots in the tires, which is both bad and good. Bad because there's flat spots in the tires, but good because that means that no one's been driving it. Um, and I forgot to look at the mileage before I took off. But it's so peaceful compared to the other car. It's like it, it's just so chill. Oh god. Oh, no, don't do that. Actually, the funny thing is the Lexus has a better turning radius than this car, which doesn't seem right, but it's all-wheel drive, so it makes enough sense. I was gonna say the Lexus can't do this. I done goofed. I was supposed to go to the shop today, but I have the epiphany that I don't think I've ever been more angry at an inanimate object than the last time that I tried to do the job that I was going to do today. And I called Proctor Subaru down in Tallahassee. It was only like $350 labor, and honestly, I would pay that three times over to not have to do that job again. So. It puts me in a little bit of an interesting situation here because I still ordered parts that were being delivered here, so I have to wait for those parts to get here. And I could go down to the shop today, but honestly, I would, it doesn't, like, there's no reason for me to. So instead, I want to spend the entire day editing through the mess of horrible, awful recording that I've done over the past week. Um, try to get in the right mindset for going into recording week three, because Week one I recorded pretty well. I was like it wasn't too bad. Week two, this past week, awful. I recorded goddamn everything. So next week, <laughs> I really need to like be extremely um, placed because otherwise I just won't be able to. I, I, I will have a snowball's chance in hell of editing that. But right now I got my coffee. I'm gonna go to the laptop. 
I think I'm just gonna spend the day editing. I think it's done.